those individuals have been on uh, and part of the administration for some time. April, Sarah, a couple questions, two questions. Um, going back to the issue of Eric Garner, a couple of weeks ago when I asked you about Alton Sterling, Stephon Clark, and uh, the issue of Eric Garner, you said it was a local issue. Does this White House give the directive now to the Justice Department that it's a local matter and that's why it's kind of been held up? Is that what's going on now with this Eric Garner case? Uh, I can't speak to anything specific um, in an ongoing uh, process that's taking place at the Department of Justice. Um, we haven't given specific instruction to them other than uh, to follow the law. And when it is a local issue, there's not a lot we can do. But when the Department of Justice has a role to play, we want them to be independent and follow the law on that front. The last thing I want to follow up on, Jim, um, when you said breeding, um, the president was very clear in his statement um, about this issue. He said in a tweet, there's a revolution going on in California. So many sanctuary areas went out of this ridiculous crime infested and breeding concept. What did he mean by breeding? Again, the president has recognized that this is a major problem, and a lot of people, uh, even in California, want to see the issue of sanctuary cities addressed, and the president's doing what he can what to do that. Mean? What does breeding mean to this president? Because when you think of breeding, you think of animals breeding, populating. I, I, I'm not going to begin to think what you think. Um, you certainly, I think that uh, it can mean a lot of things to a lot of people. Um, but the president is talking about a growing problem, and I addressed that with Jim. I don't have anything else to add. Thank you.